hope you are okay. Uh, so this video is going to be a chatty one, um, very informal. Um, I have been doing some role plays as well, um, but this is my second chatty video and I have no idea why, but I am just getting more of an urge to um, film as myself at the moment, which I never thought would happen. Um, I think it probably does have something to do with the fact that I'm not at home and I don't have my usual setup. Um, and lo-fi just kind of makes me want to just be a bit chattier. So I hope that is okay. <laughs> um, so if you saw my other um, chatty video, you will have heard me mention that I'm working away at the moment. And I'm working on a pantomime. Um, I'm actually in the pantomime, which I don't think I said before. So what I thought I would do today is do a little kind of get ready with me. And I will do my makeup for the show. Um, so it's going to be very relaxed. There is no structure. And I'm just going to see if I can get it done, basically. Um, so I've got two shows today. Uh, I would normally do my makeup at the theatre, um, but I, I share a dressing room and I don't really want to ask anyone to be quiet because it feels a bit rude. Um, and I didn't want to do that thing where you do it and then do a voiceover because I just didn't. Um, so I'm doing it here today, but that's all right. So, um, I don't know if I will uh, really talk about the products as I go because I'll feel like a bit of a fraud, but I can, I'll try and then we will see. So this is my foundation <laughs> and um, it's Rimmel Masting Radiance in True Ivory, whatever that means. Oh, before I start, I'm just going to move my hair because I keep catching it on the microphone. Um, yeah, so my, well, so the pantomime that I am in is Aladdin. Um, and it's not, I don't, if you've ever seen the Aladdin pantomime, you'll know it's not really similar to the, um, like the Disney film or anything. It's quite different. Um, oh, there's a lot of traffic, sorry. Um, so I'm playing a character called the Spirit of the Ring, which is um, a bit like a genie, um, but, but we do have the genie of the lamp. So I'm the Spirit of the Rings so is kind of like a, um, a slightly less powerful version. <laughs> um, if you've seen pantomimes before um, you'll know that in most stories there's um, a fairy or some sort of magical being and I'm kind of the equivalent to that I suppose um, yeah and it's really fun and um, I'm kind of a comedy character I suppose um, so I get some really good lines and I just get to be a bit silly and she's a bit, she's a bit cheeky, which is just really, really fun. Um, and also she is so sparkly, as you will see. Because um, I have to make my makeup match the sparkliness of my costume. Um, so it's a bit wild and there is glitter involved, which means that I am basically covered in glitter for the next two months. Um, but that's alright, can't complain. <laughs> Um, so yes, oh, this is concealer, uh, 
oh it's Rimmel again, Lasting Radiance in in Ivory I must just say disclaimer, you've already guessed but disclaimer, not a makeup artist at all um, I do my makeup because it needs to be done and the joy of doing makeup for theatre is that I am miles away from the audience so if it's not neat which it definitely isn't it doesn't matter <laughs> uh, so yes the, um, we've been doing the show for a week now we had we had a week of rehearsals and then um we've got five weeks of shows all together so we're in week two i believe um and we've just started our run of double show days we were just started off with just doing one a day and now we're doing two a day which is great it's not actually that tiring though not it's not too bad um yeah it's really fun and so I was meant to do this pantomime last year and then obviously everything kind of put, was put on hold so it's been a bit of a long time coming um, so I did like the, the promo for it um, like summertime 2020 around then whenever it was fine to do things in the UK in the summer last year that's when I did all my all like the publicity photos and then over a year later we actually get to perform so it feels very 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 special and yeah I just thought I would share a little bit of my life on here um, didn't think I would do that in all honesty but I'm quite enjoying it, why not? we're friends aren't we? So, <laughs> okay right, my eyebrows I have never had them done ever will occasionally take a tweezer to them but I mean it's been it's been a long time since I've done that so I just I'm just not bothered and you know how they say sisters not twins well second cousin <laughs> twice removed Um, and this is the, oh you can see it, one, no, Incredibrow, I think it's collect, Collection, I don't know, oh no it is, yeah, Collection, Collection, Incredibrow, um, so yeah I don't actually do this one, I don't really put that much makeup on in real life, real life, um, because basically I need, my skin needs a bit of a rest, especially at the moment, but that's okay, it makes it feel more special when I do put it on anyway, okay, so that's a little bit of base done. So let's move on to the eyes, yeah, let's have some colour. So, um, I'll just quickly explain my costume so that it makes sense. So, um, my costume is gold and it's like these gold like harem pants and a sequin top in gold and then I have these big like, shoulder pads that attach 
um, and a sequin as well with beads on them. And then I have a gold cape, which has like metal rods in them so I can manipulate the cape. And then um, I have a wig and she's called Felicia. Um, and she is like blonde, curly, and she's been put up so she's literally like this tall. She's phenomenal. She's like a big beehive. And then I've got a ginormous green gem in the middle of it. So I'm all gold with this green gem. Oh, and my shoes, like, they like curl at the toes. So, with my eyes, I try and do green with gold. So, I do green to kind of pick out the the gem and then gold because gold. So, yeah, I've had this for a couple of years. This palette, which is so dirty, but it's been, it's been through the mill. It's been on some journeys with me. Um, and it's the Proud palette, which is by Jolie Beauty. And um, when you purchase this palette, uh, I can't remember how much, but a percentage of the price goes to a Pride charity. So it was a no-brainer, really. And then if I open it up here, so it says on the top, be proud of who you are. And then all these colours, as you can see, each line is a colour of the rainbow. So then it's just different shades of each colour. And then at the bottom is all these pressed glitters. And each shade is um, named after like an inspiring member of the LGBTQ+. I really hope I've said that right. Um, community and then the glitters are positive affirmations so it's just amazing um, and you can see here that the pink one's been used a lot so in 2019 I did Sleeping Beauty and I was the fairy and I was pink from head to toe I was it's a sparkly marshmallow it was amazing so I, um, my eyes were pink, and this time I'm green with a little bit of the gold as well. So um, I'm going to do this yellow here and this green and then kind of mix them together. Um, and this is where you see that I have absolutely no technique and I am only using one brush for all of this. Sorry, not sorry. So, <laughs> I'm just going to go all the way on the lid with it. Um, so, yeah, my other excuse for being rubbish at makeup is that I, um, in a minute, I'm going to put glitter on top of it all. So, it doesn't matter what the technique. It's just so fun. It goes through like a Kermit the Frog stage. But we uh, we trust the process. I need to move that plant. <laughs> so I hope everyone is doing well. Sorry, I hope you are doing well. I still talk to one person. Um... When I'm filming this, it is the 2nd of December, um, and it's, a bit, it's Christmas crazy where I am. Um, I don't have an advent calendar, but I didn't get one because um, every single year of my existence, my mum has got me one and I just have a feeling 
when I see her, she's going to give me an advent calendar. And that's not me just being spoiled. I just don't want to, <laughs> if you know what I mean. Um, so yeah. Okay, so over here, these colours look completely different, but I promise they are the same. Take this, oh, this green one here and just kind of deepen in the in the crease. Oh sorry if you can hear somebody shouting. <laughs> I think someone's in a World of Warcraft raid downstairs. <laughs> yes, definitely. That's okay. I have I have texted him to be quiet, but I don't really mind. We're low fi, we're chilling. I think the cars are louder anyway. <laughs> are we looking like a thing? Yeah, yeah. It's not too. So, um, I have three more days after today in this, uh, where I am right now. So in this cottage and in this theatre. And then we pack it all down. Um, and then it goes, everything goes in a van. And... We have a couple of days off um, and I'm doing some other little bits of work and then we move into our second home and do the show there for three weeks ish and then we finish on the 28th of December and that's it so with a week of rehearsals and two weeks of performing we're nearly halfway through which is a bit scary it all happened so fast but it's been really fun well it still is really fun And we um, we picked our secret Santa yesterday, and I have absolutely no idea what to get my person. I'm rubbish, and I always want to make sure that it's a really good present. I always worry, and it just uh, it consumes me far more than it needs to. Okay. So, we are going in with some eyeliner, um, again, with the wings, sisters, not twins, acquaintances. <laughs> um, but I, I don't stress too much actually on this because, um, oh good grief. Because um, I have, I have lashes, but I'm not going to put them on here, um, because well, they're at the theatre. That's actually why I haven't got them with me. Um, yeah, and I like to put. 
put them on last minute anyway because I'm a bit fidgety and I'll pull them off. But I quite like doing this makeup, I find it um very relaxing. It's actually quite nice doing it here. One of my my like daily dose of my own ASMR <laughs> every day. universe knows that I'm filming right now and it made these wings happen. <laughs> okay, so this is the fun bit. So now we go in with the glitter um, and I'm not going to do this with a brush because I don't want to. I'm going to do this with my finger. I'm going to take the green one first and we're going to do that on the outside. So I'm going to put that on here. And like that. And is that okay? Yeah. And then the same on the other side. If I have caught my hair on this microphone, Okay, so then I'm going to keep this on my finger and I'm going to dip into the gold and then carry on, go further in. So yeah, I don't, I don't really mind if the green glitter comes in because then it just, uh, it blends it without me having to do anything, which is nice, isn't it? take my little finger, it's going to put some yellow just on my tear duct, is that the word? Yes, and then and then have some more glitter, more This time it is from this Revolution uh, palette, which I actually used more for Sleeping Beauty because there's pink in it, but there's this white one here, which has been used, as you can see. Um, so I just put the white in the corners here, because then it just brightens it up, look at that, Whoa. and then this side, look at that, and then just to kind of keep it from being one, two, three, let's go over the top 
so the white will catch the light a little bit as well. Fall out, fall down, whatever it's called. But that's okay. That is not a problem. You can get my trusty sun and water. shambolic video I've ever made. I really hope that uh, nobody thinks this is a tutorial. It is not. It is a what strawberry moon flat for half an hour. Should have been a smaller brush. <coughs> but it's okay. Right. Um, so I'll just leave that a second because I'm a bit sick of touching my eyes. So I'll do a mascara in a minute. Um, I'll do some lips, I think. So, oh, they're getting a bit dry from all of this. So this is, I don't know what this lipstick is, no idea, I've used it so much the label's worn off, and um, apologies, you probably noticed this before in my videos, one, one side of my top lip is a lot higher than the other, I don't know why I've just pointed that out, but here we are, because now it's all you're going to see. Um, but I, I just can't get it even because I, because I see my face all the time. I don't even notice it. And then when I see it on pictures and my face is the other way around. <laughs> but I'm over it. It doesn't bother me anymore. So we have a bright red. And then we go back. Some more glitter out. We're going to use the gold. Um, I tried a few different things when I was first doing this. I tried doing the red glitter, but it was um, it was a bit dark. It needed another colour on top, like on top of the red. Um, and it does look a bit bizarre um, right now. But once the the wigs on and the colour of the costume and stuff, it all like bounces off each other, kind of thing. And it's lovely. One thing I haven't actually done, I've never th I've not thought about this until just now, I've not done anything with my eyes on my brow bone. I 
just add it. Probably should have done some white or something. But we're a week in now and it's not bothered anybody. I think it's fine. I think we've got enough going on, haven't we? Um, okay. Where is my fluffy brush? Big brush. It's here. What? So we're going to go back to the base. And do a little bit of oh, bronzing and shaping and stuff. Um, my hair's already kind of done. Um, I might redo it. Basically, I just I put it in these plaits, um, and then I grip it up, kind of there um, because it uh, just means I can grip it gives me lots of things to grip into for the wig um, but yeah I woke up with this hair so I might do it again we'll see <laughs> Under here. Ooh. And then this is, oh sorry, this is oh Rimmel again. Sounds like she's sponsored by Rimmel, doesn't it? And it's the one that's got three there's a highlighter, a bronzer and a blusher. But I don't use highlighter on stage just because it can make me look a bit shiny in the wrong way aka sweaty um, and you know there's, in, there's enough enough shine Uh, yeah, and I'm going to take this brush out, and this is collection, and it's very pink. It's in bashful, so it's really, really pink. So I just do that, just so it's not too overwhelming. I um, I played Goldilocks in the summer, and I needed to have quite rosy cheeks, so I got this. It was amazing. Okay. I'm quite happy with that. It's a bit, a bit of a weird shape going on there, but we're gonna we're gonna ignore it and move on. Pretend it's not happening. So the last thing I'm gonna do then is just a little bit of mascara. And I don't, probably I should put this on uh, when I have put my lashes on and I will put more on. Um, but I just want to put it on because I feel a bit weird. Not that this is really going to help, but you know. <laughs> um, yeah. Look at that. Beautiful. I think I've got it on my face. Yes, I have. Um, I might see if I can find a way to put a picture of my character in the thumbnail or something along with an action shot of me doing this. Just so you can see the final thing. Because right now it's a bit frightening, isn't it? I hope you've got your eyes closed. Um, yes. So, uh, as ever, I hope everybody is, I hope you are doing well, and I hope you're taking care of yourself. And, uh, taking
taking it easy where you can. Don't work too hard, please. Um, be kind to yourself and to other people. Um, and I hope you're all right. Uh, thank you so much for watching. If you made it to the end, thank you so much. Um, if you are new here, please feel free to subscribe to this channel. We are a small but perfectly formed little family um, and we're growing at a nice slow and steady pace. Um, I'd like to get to a thousand subscribers though. It's just a nice, nice little number to aim for, isn't it? Um, I think as I post this, as I film this, I'm on 739. I ain't going to get to a thousand by uh, the new year, but we can, we can aim. Let's aim, should we aim for 800? We'll try. 750, 750. <laughs> um, but yes, so thanks for watching and I hope it was interesting-ish to get a little bit more of an insight into my life and I will see you very very soon